practical toys like the zoetrope, praxinoscope and thaumatrope were invented in the 19th century as both entertainment and as experiments with the moving image. The zoetrope is a drum with slots cut in. The drum is rotated. A strip of paper featuring sequences of drawings is placed in the zoetrope with the drawings facing the centre. Each drawing differs slightly. As the drum is rotated, the drawings appear to move as you look through the slots around the edge. The praxinoscope is a similar device to the zoetrope. It uses a series of drawings, but this time the sequences are on a paper disc. The praxinoscope is rotated and the mirrors reflect the drawings and create the illusion of movement. The thaumatrope is a simple optical toy which is easy to make. For this thaumatrope design, you'll need a sheet of card, a pencil, a pair of scissors, some wool or string about 80 centimetres long, colouring pens or pencils, something round to use as a template, a roll of sellotape is a good size, and something to make holes. I'm using a hole punch, but you could just use your pencil. Draw your circle. This one is about seven and a half centimetres in diameter. Cut your circle out. We're making a well-known thaumatrope design, which features a bird and a cage. On one side of your card, draw your cage. Don't make it too small. Turn over your card by rotating it bottom to top. Your cage will now be upside down on the back of the card. This is an important step so you avoid your bird ending up upside down inside the cage. Draw the bird in the middle of your card and colour it in. Outline your bird cage with dark coloured pen. Punch two holes on either side of the circle. I'm using the cage as a guide. Don't place the holes too near the edge. Cut your wool or string into two and thread each piece through the holes and tie a knot at the end. Hold your thaumatrope and spin. Try your own version. A design which features a container and something that's in the container works well. For example, a rabbit in a hutch, a fish in a bowl, butterflies or insects in a jar, or a sculpture in a display case. 